some examples where we find the average gradient. Please pause the video and try on your own. Determine the average gradient between x is negative 3 and x is 1 on the graph f of x is equal to negative 3x squared plus 2x minus 1. So we know that the gradient formula is the change in the y divided by the change in the x. And it must be the corresponding change. Okay. Now, in this example, all we are given are the x values. But because we are also given the equation for the graph, we can calculate the y values for those given x values. So if we want the y value when x is negative 3, we would just calculate the function value of negative 3. If we want the y value when x is 1, we calculate the value of the function where x is 1. And then at the de in denominator, we have negative 3 subtract 1. So the f of negative 3 is calculated by sub uh, substituting negative 3 in place of x throughout the equation. We then subtract, and we now want to substitute this value of 1 into the equation. And that will all be divided by negative 4. Negative 3 subtract 1 is negative 4. Right, if we calculate, if we first calculate that the f of negative 3, we get negative 41 over 2. If you calculate the f of 1, you get negative a half. And the overall gradient, if you calculate that, is positive 5.